So my workflow for CDs, I use a sunder to rip them. Usually a sunder with the CDs will fill out the tracks and the titles. And if not, you can always uh, enter them. Then I use uh, Discogs to get the art. And here's the art, and you can save the image as. And then I uh, upload it to my uh, NAS, because for some reason I can't get a sunder to uh, go to the NAS. That's a good thing, because it <coughs> gives me uh, less chance to mess up the files on the NAS. So, I've got this classic treasures sampler. So I'll put the uh, disc in the CD tray. I've got a old enough uh, laptop that uh, that has a CD. Then I wait until it uh, comes up and says, do you want to play? I cancel out of that. Go here. <coughs> Type in a sunder, and it comes up and gets all that. So, then I just rip it. And it takes a long time because my preferences are to uh, check for uh, the uh, any logic errors because these are used CDs. One thing I should say <coughs> is that. Uh, check to make sure the genre and uh, year is uh, okay. Otherwise you'll have to go through each one of these and put in the genre and the year. So when you're on Discogs you can tell release in the genre. If you can't get a uh, album art just use your phone, take a uh, picture of it, use GIMP to go 4.75 by 4.75, put that in the uh, Kid 3 to get the uh, album art on the uh, tracks. As I was saying, <coughs> preferences, advanced, um, let me see, right here, faster ripping, no error correction, that was checked, I unchecked it because, like I said, the uh, CDs are used, there probably needs to be some error checking. Once I have the CD ripped, I will then go to KID 3. That's it. <coughs> okay, <coughs> so I go down to the JPEG, right click that album art. Embed album art, and it says, Okay, we did that. So, if you go and look at each one, the album art over on the uh, right hand lower side is there. Then you have to save. Once you've saved it, you can get out of that, then you can go and Copy that, go to the NAS, music, paste it, and then 
once you paste it, you have to tell Cody that it's there. You go to uh, Music Files, do a, go to the uh, new file, hit the C, and then uh, update the library. And that's all there is to it.